So sick of making up to make the same mistake You give the love you want but one you cannot take and welcome back to my channel. Welcome to the January episode of The Actor Diaries. Today is Thursday, January 5th. 2023. And Mom and I are currently on our way, sorry about this whack lighting, to see Mean Girls at the Pantages. Woo! Very, very exciting. I saw Mean Girls on Broadway in 2019 and now we are seeing it on tour. Mom's never, you've never even seen the movie. No, I've never even seen Mean Girls. I'm a big fan of Lindsay Heather Pierce and she's playing Janice, so I'm very excited to see her. Oh my god, hey, hi, hi vlog, I'm here with Julia, Julia, we're at Mean Girls, Yes. can't wait. Today is Saturday, January 14th, and I am about to film a self-tape. This audition came in pretty late last night, and when I saw what it's for, <laughs> this show that I'm auditioning for has been my dream show since I started watching the show before I even really got into acting, and I've always said that I want to be on this show. Like, I have so many videos literally saying out loud how I'm manifesting one day being on this show, and so when I got the email, again, it was late last night, I was not expecting, you know, to get an audition at that hour, and when I opened the email and I read what the audition was for, I could not. I just could not believe it. It is such an honor to even audition for this show regardless of the outcome I'm so grateful for this opportunity and that's kind of the best feeling going into an audition is just being grateful for the chance to be seen It's such a special feeling when you get to audition for something that you are a fan of or you've been watching for a long time And so I'm just I'm really excited about this audition and again regardless of what happens I'm just really grateful for this opportunity. I memorized my sides and worked on all of that, so now I just need to set up my little self-tape area. Here is today's self-tape setup. Every time it kind of looks a little bit different because even however many years into the pandemic and into self-tapes, I'm still trying to figure out the best setup for me. But I have my ring light that won't be on, it's just holding my phone, and I'm gonna have my friend Josh on Zoom on my phone. He's so sweet and he's gonna be my reader today. And then I have my tripod that will be holding this camera. This is my blue backdrop. I think I got this on Amazon, but it's super great. I film all my self tapes in front of this. Why are you out of focus? Okay. And then I have these two folding chairs and my desk chair that is holding my ring light. It has been raining all day, which has been so nice. And I just want to go out and be in the rain. I love the rain so much, but I just hope it doesn't start to pour right as I start to film because that wouldn't be great for the sound.
so change of plans. I'm going to be going to my coach's house tomorrow morning to work on this audition and tape it with her. All of this was kind of for nothing because I'm not going to be taping today, but that's okay. I just wasn't really feeling it and I never want to submit a tape that I'm not fully proud of, especially if it's for a project that I'm super passionate about. Those of you that act or do auditions know the feeling of just looking at lines too many times or just getting fried reading a script and I never want to approach the work that way. And so I'm just gonna put this down for today and go do something else and then I can get it done with my coach tomorrow morning. got home from a nice little family dinner and for the rest of the night I'm just going to edit and get ready for tomorrow so I will see you guys when I'm on my way to my coaching hi guys happy Sunday I just got to my coaching this neighborhood is so gorgeous and the weather is so nice right now but yeah I'm gonna go tape my audition and I will see you after talk really fast but I just submitted my tapes there is no greater feeling than sending off an audition the coaching was super intense so I'm a little I don't know <laughs> just so it's intense um, it's currently 105 I'm gonna go grab food right now and then head over to a friend's house and yeah that'll be it for today and I will see you guys Today is Saturday, January 21st. I am currently at Colleen Ballinger's concert. I have been a huge Colleen fan since I was like 12 years old. I was obsessed with Miranda Sings. This photo was a centerpiece at my bat mitzvah. That is how much of a Miranda Sings crazy fan I was. She is truly a huge inspiration to me and I'm very grateful that I was able to come to the concert. wanted to come on here and talk about a few things that have been on my mind. So this series is called The Actor Diaries, but mostly what I show in these videos is me going to an event or doing an audition. Everything is very positive, I feel, which is what I want to document and what I want to remember. But the actual day-to-day -day of this journey, you know, pursuing acting as a career, there's a lot that I don't share. I've gone through a number of audition processes in the past month or two where I make it all the way to the end and I don't get the job which you know happens and it's all part of the process but sometimes in those moments where I'm really really upset over not getting a project that I made it to the end for or I'm really passionate about I'm not vlogging that and I'm not sharing that because I don't you know really want to put that on the internet but that's all part of the journey and there are ups and downs like there is to anything in life. What I'm trying to say is that it's not the full story and I know we all know this but this is something that I have to remind myself of all the time with social media and I think especially you know YouTube you're able to share so much more of your life than like a photo on Instagram and so doing a series called The Actor Diaries you watch it and maybe you think that that 
is, you know, everything that I did in the month. But it's, it's just, it's not. I'm picking what I want to share and I'm making it pretty and I'm making it positive because that's how I try to live my life and that's the energy that I want to share. I just want to stay as real as I possibly can with you guys. I know the feeling of watching someone's video related to a dream that you have. I know so many of you guys are actors and are aspiring actors and I know what it feels like to watch a video of someone who's doing the thing that you want to do and just feel so... Uh, just want that so badly and just think like oh their life is perfect and they just go to these events all the time and they just have all these auditions and xyz it's just so important to remember that you're not seeing the full story with all that being said i am so so grateful for everything in my life and i'm excited to keep sharing the journey with you guys this is going to be the end of this month's episode of the actor diaries thank you for watching make sure to subscribe if you haven't already and i will see you in my next video Bye.